Hi guys, in this video I will show you how to make 3D mask transition easy and fast on vertical videos. I've already made that tutorial but, videos were horizontal and I have received too many messages that you were asking me to do on vertical videos as well. So let's begin. First of all go to the moment from where you want to start mask transition and move your second video there. Now select your first clip and rename it to, original. Duplicate original and rename it to, roto brushed. Now grab a roto brush tool and double click on roto brushed layer. Make selection of the car and foreground only, simply do it like in this video. Then press space bar and check if selection follows the car and foreground perfectly. If not, stop there, correct the selection and then check again. Once you are happy with it, click on freeze button. Once the freezing is done, go back to composition. Toggle off original layer and check if you're happy with the mask. In my case I want to smooth the edges, so I will add feather under the roto brush, let's set it to 10. Toggle on original layer now and we are ready to make mask transition. First of all go to the moment where the very bottom clip starts from, then select original layer and press T to open opacity. Click on opacity stopwatch icon to create keyframe there. Then go forward something like this and change opacity to 0%. First step is ready. Now create new camera. Leave everything as default. Move camera layer above other layers. Now create null object. Link camera layer to null and enable 3D on all layers. Press U on original layer to see only created keyframes. Now select null layer, go to the moment where your very bottom clip starts from and press P on your keyboard to open position. Click on position stopwatch icon. Then go to the moment where the original layer ends and start scaling like this. Make sure to move last keyframe to very end. Now go to the moment where opacity second keyframe is, select roto brushed layer and press P on your keyboard. Click on position stopwatch icon to create a keyframe. Make sure this two keyframes are in line. Then go forward and change position all the way down. Move that keyframe to the end as well. Let's quick check. Nice, we are already done. Let's adjust the scale and position of the second clip. Select very bottom layer and press P on your keyboard. Adjust scale and position on your wish. That looks amazing. Now we have this black edges issue. To fix it, add motion tile effect on very bottom clip. Toggle on mirror edges. Change height and width to 150. Once we have fixed it, let's smooth the transition. Select first keyframes and press F9 on your keyboard to easy ease them. Then go to graph editor. Right click and make sure edit speed graph is selected. Now make a smooth curve like mine. Select second keyframes and press F9. Then go to graph editor and make a smooth curve like in the video. Let's check what we have got. I'm happy with it. Lastly enable motion blur on all layers and we are done. Hope this video was helpful. Thanks for watching and like the video please.